Hello, hello, hello. It's been fucking ages. We have a demo courtesy of Des coming live from a few months ago during XDWC. We have Pop, who is uh, Vert versus Rainbow Shadow, who's Rainbow Shadow. Um, there was a bit of a a bit of a kerfuffle between the two, and they said, "Let's go one v one." Pop Vert has basically never played Duel very much. Rainbow Shadow has played a lot of Duel. Is an incredibly good Dueler. We're on error walk. We've slightly missed the start because I didn't think it was a false start. But here we go. We are back with commentary. Ah, I've missed doing this so much. Let's go! Right, Rainbow Shadow is starting off with the Mega Health. I'm going to get the Rockets. Hopefully Pop's picked up this health, but I believe he probably got the spawn in it, but didn't get the spawn in it. Gets fragged straight away. Rainbow Shadow's managed to get the type frag over there on the spawn. Now watching the spawn. Literally doesn't even know where the webs are. Just bullying Rainbow Shadow. This is bullying. Rainbow is an incredibly good player. Um, we do have that strafe bar. I should probably have moved that before we started recording. But there we go. Um, these guys, I mean, it was during XDWC. Let's keep the strafe bar. Let's keep the strafe bar. Lovely shot there. Going to be fragging. Yeah, it's just... That's what happens when you play Arrow Walk. It's, uh, it's an incredible map, but you've got to expect that to happen. You've got to be able to do it to even play Arrow Walk, really, to compete. Pop, absolutely popping off. Surviving on one health just there. We are at the sort of the mercy of whatever the hell Dez was managing to look at. Uh, Dez also not a duelist, so he's not going to have all of the spectator configs. But there we go. Pop manages to get one frag, but that only puts... Oh, no, it's a self-frag? What happened? Da, da, da. Oh, we're now watching Pop. We're now watching Pop. Uh, uh, sorry. I thought Rainbow Shadow had died. Nope. Pop managing to pick up a couple of little bits of health and armor going around. How the hell did he dodge that? Goes down again, gets the spawn frag. We're gonna probably be watching a fair few bits of spawn fragging, but Rainbow Shadow. We're back over to watch him now. Gets a nice shot using the teleport as well. Definitely still knows the teleporters then. I believe Rainbow Shadow had not played a lit for a little while. Um, like majorly in duels because of uh, XDWC. I've just realised I still have infinite uh, blasty what's it's on. I really should get a proper casting config again. I didn't want to exec my old recording config because I've got so many different configs now. It wouldn't have worked when I tried to set everything back. But we, uh, yeah, I really need to sort out my my casting configs and everything. 14 to 0 with three minutes or two and a half minutes into the game. Lovely movement. Pops managed to pick up a good bit of health and armor, but just unable to do any damage. What's the damage numbers looking like? I mean, we're looking at literally 300 damage dealt by Pop. It's, it's absolutely nothing. Um... Uh, Rainbow Shadow just unable to connect with a lot of those shots there, but does manage to get the kill. And now back to the spawn fragging. Pop realizing that going through the teleporter is the worst idea you can do in that situation, because uh, obviously Rainbow Shadow will immediately hear you've gone through the hit, hear the hit, hear you've gone through the teleporter, and then make the play. Nice little fake out, probably not entirely intended there by uh, Pop, but remember Pop is vert. But we're saying uh, pop because it's just easier for me to use people's names, whatever they are, inside of the game. Just is easier for me. Lovely air frag there. Not quite connecting with that rocket, but a lovely shot nonetheless. Now we get to see some great movement there from Rainbow Shadow. Beautiful shot, predicting where pop was going to be. The amount of uh, cells on this on this map. It is a small amount of cells for the uh, Electro and Vortex, especially the amount that Rainbow Shadow uses it. A lot of people do avoid using the um, using the Electro on this map for some reason, but it's incredibly powerful in this game. I think it's potentially because it's actually... Um, it doesn't replace the, uh, the LG, 
It, it does in position, but in terms of like it, it, the position you'd use it is not really where you get it from. Well, I think people forget about the Electro a lot as well in Xenotic, to be honest, especially coming f through from other games. But I'm 30. I've not seen an Armageddon in a duel I've commentated, I don't believe. I've had them happen to me. I've I mean, I've played Dodger, but uh, even Dodger sometimes kills himself. Vert is just getting absolutely dominated here. Putting up a fairly decent fight, though, considering he has literally not played Duel in this game. I think potentially has, like... It's certainly not a lot of... Uh, of Dual experience. Oh, the audio is going to kill. Stats. Stats. Nautic. Dog. Let's see. Oh. Guys, using a fake nick at the minute. I can't find it. No mind. Um. Yeah, can't find his account. Damn it. Uh, so you see how many duels he's played. Probably literally is just this one or th like three I think they played halfway through though. But, you know, we always say the second half of the game is usually played with more frags. Uh, 37 might be difficult to overcome. But, you know, with four minutes remaining, I'd always say that four minutes is enough to overturn any deficit. Usually. Um... Uh, the game's stopped giving a shit about giving points every 10 because 40 is just ludicrous. In fact, I've had Armageddon once in this game. Um, like, like, I've done it in a... I went completely clean in a... in a DM. Unfortunately, that... did happen with a locked down account. But, oh well. Rainbow Shadow now just floating around, just sitting about, really. It is very much an Arrowwalk playstyle, just to sit around, uh, hoover up the armors, hoover up the hells. You know, you're right next to both, just sitting where Rainbow is. And then all you've got to do is spike out a little bit. We can see that the timers, you know, we've got, got plenty of time. We've got eight seconds till the Mega. And then, you know, 15 seconds till the, till the Mega Armor. There's the Mega Health. Gonna play a bit protective. It is interesting that Rainbow Shadow has actually not stopped playing that sort of tactical game. A lot of people, when they come up against an opponent that is less, very much less capable, like a lot less capable than them, they'll start playing in a completely different manner against that opponent. But the interesting thing here is that um, Rainbow hasn't. Rainbow is genuinely playing. Just the way that I would say he would against me. I'm, I'm not an amazing player, but I do know how to hold my own. And I hope we are learning from this. We're, we're going to make sure that we learn from this. I always try to make sure that people learn from these demos. No matter what. No matter what the score is. There's always something you can learn. Because quite often in these games, you know, we don't have... Um, we don't have enough players to always get an even game. And sometimes you do have to play people that are just going to dominate you. And you have to be able to learn from those experiences to get better at the game. To be able to dominate those players. But it will take a lot longer than being able to play people your own level and actually uh, work up from that. It is very difficult. Oh, beautiful connection there, right on the spawn, connecting the two at exactly the same time for only one hit. And then, connecting with the 60. 60 in a row as well. Oh, we have 1k damage dealt. That's the thing, you, you're doing 1,000 damage. I mean, look, we've got 7.5k to 1k. You wouldn't think that the score would be 63 to 0. But Rainbow's never actually dipped below 50 health in this, I don't think. 
Um, he hoovered up that mega and armor at the start. That's the better start in Xenotic. Uh, it's objectively better because our, all armor is the same. It is just straight up more health. You can take more hits. Um, you are on the lower, so it is, you know, potentially positionally, it is a little bit worse. So that does kind of balance it out, but uh, considering Rainbow did actually manage to pick up the Mega Armor as well. But yeah, hopefully we'll be able to learn something from these games. Sorry about the like, slight interlude <laughs> of, in my talking. Pop has managed to get a kill. Managed to stop the absolute perfect game. There is no 69-0, to zero, but... As we can see, Pop wins. I believe the bet may have been you won't get one kill on me. But there we go. He did. Incredible stats for Rainbow Shadow. Very well played. It was definitely well played. And a, a Pop, uh, Pop Vert definitely put up a good fight. Good play from both of them. I, I look forward to doing more than these if I can. Cheers for watching. And I will see you, hopefully, in not quite as long as it's taken me since last time. ta -ra.